Certainly you've heard of pie eating contest, you've even seen the hot dog eating contest, but what about bug eating contests? Well, if that sounds great to you, you want to make sure that you get out to the Denver County Fair because you can eat all the bugs you want out there. Robert Nathan Allen from the Little Herds is here to tell us about the event, and you've brought Michaela and Angie with you. Nice to see you this morning. Thanks, Tom. So I, I see we have a plate of bugs. I also see we have brownies and cookies here. Are those made from bugs? Absolutely. So we've taken bugs, and these are raised for people to eat. These are crickets here, Correct. these in particular. And then we've turned them into a cricket flour. It's going to be a high nutrient flour. Is that all that's in here? It's just ground into flour? 100% crickets. Okay, 100% crickets there, right there. Then you can take that and you can add it into recipes, protein bars, cookies, bread, pastas. And now you've got a healthier food, more sustainable food, and you don't have to see the legs. I was going to say, and it also probably sounds more like something you would hand to someone. But I, I do want to bring uh, Vicki and Kim over here and join me. Uh, normally we'd use toothpicks and all. And uh, <laughs> would you like a cricket? Now, what's on these crickets? Nothing. These are just 100% dry toasted. I thought we were going to eat the bars. No, no. These are <laughs> dry toasted. You're to work your way over. No, no. I'm going to eat one, too. We're okay. going to get Michaela, Angie. Everyone's going to get a cricket. Okay. Bit. All together now, right? The key is picking a good one. Yeah, they're crunchy mm. and the legs are falling off. Ah, uh, pick a good one. Angie, you want one? Michaela? Okay. Do you young ladies have any tips? Just, just go for it, huh? Mm -hmm. Just go. Okay. Mmm. Oh, that's nice. It's a roasted, nutty, oaty yeah. flavor. It has kind of a like a crickety flavor. Of course. It's actually yeah. not bad. Yeah. Kind of tastes like a potato Crunchy. chip. Crunchy. Have more. It does take like a, <laughs> taste like a potato chip. Just having more. So tell me about what we're going to see at the fair. So at the fair, we're going to have a lot of educational material <laughs> explaining okay. why we're talking about eating bugs. But mm -hmm. we're also going to be doing a bug eating competition. And we're also going to have bug toppings for breakfast burritos and breakfast tacos. Okay. Now I know, I know what Vicky's looking at. She's on yeah, I need, yeah. I need to wash them. It really doesn't taste bad. I just no, it doesn't. I'm having trouble with the idea. Psychological of, I issues. Just need a cricket. Well, you can check it out at the Denver County Fair. There are also cookbooks. Now, are these going to be out there as well? You'll be able to talk to people about stuff yeah. you can make via via Absol cricketage. Absolutely. We've got a couple books and some recipes that we can sh point you to online. So that if you want to try cooking at home, you can purchase crickets or flour and experiment in your own kitchen. Well, ladies, we appreciate you getting up early, coming in with us, sharing a cricket with us and, and your recipes. Robert Nathan Allen, thank you as well. Thank you, Tom. And, of course, you can get out and check out the Denver County Fair. It kicks off Friday. It's at the National Western Complex. Chris, is there any particular form of cricket you'd like to eat? Uh, you got any Miller Moths? Miller Moths are delicious. <laughs> I'd love to cook up some Miller Moths. I've got plenty of those at my house. Yeah. Hey, for